Again and again, we hear that smart women never fall for a sociopath or a narcissist. This is a misconception that is not infrequently backed up by phrases such as, that could never happen to me, or I would recognize that immediately. In fact, however, no one is protected from the machinations of a sociopath and a narcissist, because falling in love with a sociopath or a narcissist is not due to a lack of intelligence, ignorance, or a lack of certain character traits. Quite the contrary, the more a woman has qualities such as intelligence, strength, cleverness, for example, the more likely she is to be targeted by a sociopath or narcissist. In today's video, we'll explain why intelligent women in particular are much more likely to be victims and why these women in particular are so highly attractive to sociopaths and narcissists. If you like our videos, feel free to support us with a thumbs up, subscribe to Psychology and Mind, and stay tuned for the videos that await you in the future. Now let's get to the four reasons. Number one, value perception. Women tend to project their own values onto others, which makes them vulnerable to manipulation. Women in particular are social creatures who try to rationally explain their counterpart's bad behavior in order to excuse it. If no plausible explanation can be found, women may try to explain the bad behavior by other reasons, such as a traumatic childhood that led to the counterpart behaving in such a way. Often, women even look for the blame in themselves. They are more reflective than many men, and may blame themselves for the situation, and they communicate this. A fatal mistake, because this is exactly what a sociopath and narcissist perceives and uses against the victim. While women are busy excusing the behavior of their counterpart, sociopaths and narcissists are busy trying to get away with everything. Thus, many women become victims. And this is because they don't realize that they are dealing with an unconscionable person. They, like most people, can't imagine someone not feeling empathy or not showing remorse, because basically everyone should have those character traits. Number two, trauma. Trauma can be a reason to entangle love and abuse. While this is not generally true, there are still plenty of women who have experienced abuse, mistreatment, bullying, or sexual assault in their childhood or adolescence. These traumas can make the victims more vulnerable to tolerating abusive behavior, denying it, or trivializing it, because they have a. experienced worse, and b. learned to associate love with violence or danger. However, even women who experienced a loving childhood and have never encountered an unscrupulous person before can become victims because they may not know what to look for in order to recognize traits of a manipulative and malicious person. Number 3. Status Intelligent and successful women are attractive to sociopaths and narcissists because they have the financial resources they need. In particular, Wealthy, successful, intelligent, and beautiful women are targeted victims of their own desires for sociopaths, narcissists, and are therefore a particular focus for them. This is not only because they like to grace themselves with such women for their own external image, but mainly because they are particularly proud of having conquered such a strong person. These people are self-absorbed, and real feelings play a subordinate role, or no role at all. For them, it is the fun of the hunt to make a successful woman submissive. In addition, sociopaths in particular view successful and wealthy women as a source of income. They are manipulative, cheat, lie, and steal from their victims without having a guilty conscience. Unfortunately, due to his charismatic, educated, and cosmopolitan nature, a sociopath or narcissist is often the object of love for especially smart and successful women. Despite their intelligence, they are blinded by his attractive traits. Number 4. Weak Points A woman's vulnerabilities have nothing to do with intelligence and can be exploited. Sociopaths and narcissists have a sense for the unstable and vulnerable phases in a woman's life. They literally prey on them, and try to fill the void in order to then use it for themselves and their own needs. 
For example, when sociopaths and narcissists learn that a woman has recently separated, is feeling lonely, or is grieving the loss of a loved one, they know how to fulfill the deepest desires here. They flood their victims with love and know exactly how to transform themselves into the type of person their victim is most desperately seeking. This behavior is very well perceived by a woman, and she finds it extremely gratifying. The subconscious stores the information, and so it is not atypical that a woman knows deep inside that she is being manipulated. However, the desire for love takes precedence. If you want to learn more about this topic, feel free to watch our video 8 Subtle Tactics a Narcissist Uses to Manipulate. You'll find a link in the video description. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. Did you find this information helpful? Do you have experience with it? We would love to hear from you. Leave a comment below and let us know your thoughts. For more resources about mental health, self-improvement, and psychology, visit our website. You'll find the link in the video description where you can also connect with us on social media and sign up for our email list. Take care of yourself and have a beautiful day.